Hello everybody, welcome back to SimCity. As usual, this is Zephyria Nick, and we're in Bluebrin. We've got some industrial buildings upgrading to higher density as well, which is very nice. What I need to do, we need to get some more of these guys to medium wealth. Because what I've noticed is that most of the shortage we have for workers right now is in medium wealth. We have, we don't have enough medium wealth people. So, let me go to parks. Major. Let's give them a pond. An Amy pond, to be exact. Wow, that did nothing. You know what? No. No pond. I will add in a slightly larger body of water if I can find a larger body of water. Of course, there is no larger body of water. Because doesn't that make too much sense? <laughs> Good lord. Okay, well, either way, let's place that there. And let's place another one right next to it. That way, these guys will be medium wealth. Do we have medium wealth shops, actually? Shoppers, medium wealth. We have zero unsold goods. So, that means we need more medium wealth shop. And I think I can manage that. There. So we will have some going to medium wealth shops. Which is very nice, because we, like I just said, literally, seconds ago, we need them. We, I did check, we are collecting the proper amount of garbage. So we are collecting everything and burning all of it. Which, very, very nice. What, 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 what the hell do you want? Okay, you know what? Fine. We already have everything in every region. I'm not even, sh well, I think we have everything in every region, don't we? Yeah, we already have everything. The only thing we don't have is the... Simcopter 1, which we'll probably put that down at some point, but let's just place down the, uh... What is that? That's a sign! That is what it is. It's a city hall sign. I just hit my knee on the desk. I'm very, very sorry about that. Place a mayor's house. That will also help with land value. You know, mayor's house will go right there. That way the mayor has a very short walk to work. Yes. Greedy? Absolutely. <laughs> but you know what? That's how I am. I am one corrupt as hell cover uh, mayor. I almost said governor. I guess that kind of works. So, we have a very poor education level, but we are teaching citizens. That is helping people. They taught 680. Which, that could be a whole lot worse. Could be substantially better, of course, but, you know what, it can always be better. The writers per day has gone up on that slightly as well. We're still having just under a third of the total people in, our, in Blue Bren using it. I've completely ignored these people over here. <laughs> For a very long time, evidently. But very quickly, in just a matter of a few episodes, we've gotten up to about, I don't know, 25, almost 25,000 people. I think that's pretty good progress. Why are you vacant? Oh, no, 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 no. What's the problem with the police? Crime has the upper hand that it does. I don't know why I'm singing, but I guess I'm going to place down a thing of cars. Actually, I should probably use more jail cells, to be honest. Ground floor jail cells. Can I place them there and place another ground floor jail cell? These are expensive. <laughs> Police are expensive. They really are. Let's place another line of cars there. You know, I might have to idle in... Uh, I mean, we're still not particularly low on funds, but... I may have to idle over in B Nation for a while again. But that's not really a big deal. Although, I guess that does go to, sh go to show that... If you start off with about a million dollars, you can very easily set up a city that's, for the most part, pretty self-reliant on itself. And this is coming from someone who really doesn't know what is not efficient at playing these games. Oh. Water. Uh. Yeah. Let's place this. Over the bridge! <laughs> no, that's a pretty bad place for it. I say that because I want to focus on that being... Oh, well, all of the water's over here. That's a problem. Ah, uh, great. Where can I place this efficiently? Definitely not right there. I want to, uh... What is it? Right through here. Be the main gambling... Gambling? Gambling! Gambling center. So I'll just place that there. What's the problem with the fires? Fire service is slow. What do you want me to do about that? Place more trucks? I can place more trucks into this. I'm not really worried about going into... The oh! Oh, they can place on this side of the road, too. That's perfect, actually. I will max this fire station out, then. There we go. Maybe eventually we'll place down the large fire station. I say that, we probably ever won't ever. Do I ha have I ever placed that? Wait, what do you want? They're probably going to say more parks, right? Walk in the park. 100 sims in the parks. Yeah, that's probably not going to be a big deal. We've got plenty of sims and we have several parks. Although, 
Any unsold goods? No goods have gone unsold. We still have a lot of unsatisfied medium well shoppers. So you know what? Let's focus some of that energy into making medium well shops. There we go. Oh, that'll also help counteract some of the land value loss from, you know, the uh, the great water pumping station that's right there in the corner. All right, so how much of an excess do we have? 92.8, massive excess. Let me just turn that off. And where did I place the other one? I placed it right here. There we go. Both those are off now. We're still making plenty. Of, well, we're not making any money. We're not really losing a ton. But we still are pretty fine on water. Power. We won't have an issue with power for probably another few episodes, if I had to take a guess. Oh, it was, oh yeah, that was one of the ones that burnt. Sorry. No, oh, excuse me. I suddenly got the water hiccups. I notice I get hiccups if I drink too much water too quickly. Anyway, as I was going to say before I started hiccuping, what? I think I do have a plan for next episode, believe it or not. Because in case you didn't realize, or if, I mean, I didn't realize until recently, next episode should at least mark our 50th episode in this series. If that truly is indeed the case, as I feel, as I think it is, then what I think I'm going to do is go on a bit of a tour of all these cities and just explain everything with them and just kind of be a bit of a nostalgic episode, really. Oh, what are you saying? Building our car. Oh my god, really? Again? Again? You just don't- no one ever gets the point. That's three governments that are like, Herbender, you should build narcology. And that's three of them that I keep saying, no, I'm not building narcology. And they're like, oh, okay, we'll stop asking. You want to build narcology? And that's how it is all the time. I, I'm pretty sure that's not how they actually sound, but you, you get my bloody point. But what I want to try and do is I'm in a rapid hurry. Well, that's not the button I meant to click at all. I'm in a bit of a hurry to get this up and running. So let me go to culture and attractions. Now we've got a few attractions. We've got a Maxis Man statue. We've got Dolly the Dinosaur, which sounds very, very nice. A giant garden. You know, screw it. We're placing the no more than likely. Larry the Large Llama. Or the world's largest ball of twine. We can place all of them, I think. But which one are we going to have first? Larry the Large Llama? Or Giant Garden Gnome? I think we're going to place Larry. It'll be right next to a shit filter. A literal shit filter. Hello, Larry. There we go. Oh, it's got a bunch of llamas inside of it, too. That's nice. Okay, well, that works perfectly fine, I think. And then we'll just have to keep a close eye on how many people are coming into the city per day. Now, let me go back and check out police and stuff. I have an upgrade available that I won't upgrade. So, for the most part, we're pretty fine on, as far as health goes. Police is fine. Education is subpar, but, you know, that takes a lot of money. And the, uh, what is this? This is a, this isn't education. This is mass transit. What are you going to say? Is there even anything more I can really do over here? Okay, make, make more rail. Plop another passenger rail station. Can I extend this? Or is this just... Angle's too sharp, yeah. Through a what? Oh, can I... I actually want this this road to curve a bit. I mean, this road? This isn't a road. This is a train station, bitch. <laughs> there we go. And... Will that work? What? Oh, why? Does that make sense in any reality ever to anybody in anything that's ever been a thing? No. There we go. This is like the most odd way to place down a state uh, line of trail track, though. <laughs> oh, and then I will snake this. No, I don't want it to go through. Why? I don't want it to go that way. There's a reason I have my mouse on this side of the screen. Here's a crazy idea, game. It's because I wanted to go this way. Is that too foreign to you? <laughs> okay, so it accomplishes nothing by going down that far. I didn't think it would. But I still wanted to be safe. And then... Hmm. I don't think that's fine. Alright, let's place you... Let's place you... Right there. And then connect a road. Several roads, actually. Can I play... So, okay, here's what the game just did. It just let me draw a road inside of a park 
and then won't let me draw a road off of that road that's inside the park saying you can't play draw through place buildings it just would have been the pinnacle of screw this game there is no intersection <laughs> I am the intersection ah, screw it <laughs> it would have just been the screaming definition of some of the faults with this game if it hadn't let me place if it hadn't let me delete that part of the road, it would have been hilarious. But it would have shown some of the major faults this game has. So, how many, they had three kids visit Larry the Giant Llama. It, was Larry not tall enough for adults? I don't know. So, with that, I think I'm going to sign off on that, on this episode. I, it occurs to me we're completely neglecting this entire half of town. Well, let's be honest. Wait, why are you unhappy? Okay. For God's sake, look at all that. You can freaking drive. You've all got cars. And that's complete B. Well, actually, there's a very large number of unemployed, medium, well, low health workers. But you know what? I'll deal with that as time goes by. Anyway, thank you guys for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. I've, I'm still thoroughly enjoying this series. And to be honest, I'm enjoying this city more than I was enjoying Midgar. This is... Maybe it's because things are actually going fairly well with this city so far. I really don't know. But either way... I think that will... And actually, what? no, that's not going to be the thumbnail. The thumbnail will be Larry. That will be the end of this episode. Thank you guys for watching. Let me get that view. There we go. It's the best view. There is no better view than this. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I will see you guys next time.